This video will demonstrate reading fluency tracking using an iPod Touch, email, and Google Docs. This student, Alistair Graham, first uses his iPod Touch to make a recording of himself reading a selection. He will read for one minute and make note where he started and ended so he can count how many words he read. Once completed, he can listen back to how many times he stumbled over words and he will make note of that number as well. He will be sure to name his recording appropriately for when he sends it to his teacher, Mr. Rebau. He now sends the audio recording to Mr. Rebau for review and archiving. Ali can archive his recordings too if he wants. Ali has done recording himself and has sent the recording to Mr. Rebau. Mr. Rebau will now check his email. Mr. Rebau sees that he has received an email from Ali with his recording attached. He can now listen to it in iTunes. Meanwhile, Ali will use his iPod to input his data from his reading. A Google form is opened and Ali can enter specifics about his reading. This same form is a button on his iPod and will be accessed every time he reads with no need to log in. He can input the title and pages of his reading. He will choose what subject the reading falls under. Most importantly, he will input his words per minute and errors data. Ali has submitted his information to Mr. Reba. Mr. Reba can now access this important information at any time from anywhere there is internet. Just as Ali touches submit, Mr. Reba's spreadsheet fills with his data instantly. Mr. Rebo has a graph on the spreadsheet that automatically fills in with Ali's data. This updates itself every time Ali submits more reading data. Ali's fluency targeted goal can be input on the next page, and the graph will readjust itself accordingly. Notice the goal is indicated for comparing Ali's results. As time passes, Ali will fill up his reading record. Subsequently, the graph will paint a clearer picture of Ali's reading fluency strengths and weaknesses. Notice that science is much lower than the other subjects. Mr. Rebau identifies a trend in Ali's science reading and addresses it via email. Ali can receive feedback from Mr. Rebau and access it via email on his iPod Touch.